I'm Dr. Neil Baytal, and I'm greatly privileged to practice clinical and cosmetic dermatology here in beautiful Marco Island, Florida. And I am very excited to tell you that if you have acne or you know of anyone who struggles with acne, I have some exciting news for you today. Now my background and my original board certification is in family medicine, so I approach disease from the prevention and whole body perspective. So I was so excited to find out that the number one undisputed heavyweight champions of the acne world, Drs. Katie Rodan and Kathy Fields, had struck again. They were the creators of Proactive Solution, and they've done it again. Rodan and Fields Unblemish, the number one with their patented multi-med therapy. And here's what that means. We were treating acne pimples one at a time. We were treating the pimple as if that was the problem and not treating it as a skin problem. Their approach is a multi-step therapy where in each step prepares the skin for the next step so that by the time the entire regimen is done, the multiple factors that cause acne, also everything that the skin needs to remain healthy and not irritated has also been addressed. Let's look at unblemish and see how the unblemish line addresses these problems. First of all, you have step one. This addresses the inflammation of the skin. It addresses the antibacterial property that is necessary in ingredients to prepare the skin for step two. Clarifying toner. Now this toner is a non-alcohol based vehicle and it, because it doesn't have alcohol in it, is able to address the pH of the skin properly. A proper pH of the skin is very essential to skin health it also has naturally occurring uh, alpha hydroxy acids, which help exfoliate dead skin cells and clear the pores of clogging material. So this corrects the pH, it exfoliates, it clarifies. Very effective at preparing the skin for step three, which is the actual power punch of the acne treatment protocol. This is the step three, and a key ingredient here is benzoyl peroxide. Now, benzoyl peroxide is the gold standard acne treatment uh, in the history of acne. But there are a lot of misconceptions and there's a lot of problems with benzoyl peroxide in how it is often utilized. Because benzoyl peroxide is very effective at calming down the activity of the uh, oil glands, from decreasing cell turnover, which also clogs the glands, and it also uh, has a natural antibacterial effect as well. So benzoyl peroxide addresses every concern of the acne lesion in terms of prevention. The problem is it doesn't like to get into the skin. It sits on top of the skin usually, and its activity has to be inside the skin. So in the past, we have addressed that problem by driving up the concentration of the benzoyl peroxide in an attempt to drive it into the skin using a concentration gradient. The problem with that is that only a small amount gets into the skin. The rest sits on top of the skin where it causes irritation, inflammation, redness, and drying. And this is the problem with benzoyl peroxide historically. So products uh, proclaiming that they are maximum strength benzoyl peroxide, um, that's not necessarily a good thing. That can actually be a bad thing. Studies have shown that a, a concentration of 2.5% is adequate to do what we need to do. How do we approach the benzoyl peroxide problem? The fact that it is a great product, but it needs to get into the skin. Well, first of all, multi-med therapy. Each preceding step prepares the skin to be optimally receptive for the benzoyl peroxide. Also, this unit is a very well-designed unit because inside these two chambers, one is a penetration enhancement gel which allows the benzoyl peroxide to cross through the skin much more effectively. So, at the time that the pump is dispensed, the penetration gel and the benzoyl peroxide are dispensed together and that optimizes the ability of the benzoyl peroxide to reach the oil glands where it is most effective, leaving very little on the skin to cause irritation, redness, dryness, and peeling. So exciting product, very effective product, does exactly what it needs to do. The final step in the process, step four, this is the oil controlling lotion. And as a dermatologist, 
uh, I will always tell my patients who are under acne treatment that any acne regimen is going to sensitize the skin to the effects of UV. Uh, so it is very important that all patients uh, on an acne regimen use an SPF. The problem is that most SPF ingredients can be comedogenic. They can block up the oil glands, they can create a barrier layer over the skin which traps in heat and actually increases oil gland activity. So uh, Drs. Katie Rodan and Kathy Fields have uh, utilized um, very much non-barrier like, it is very much non-comedogenic. Uh, and because it's micronized, it doesn't create that white chalky look that a lot of treatments use. So excellent oil controlling lotion and excellent SPF as well. So um, very effective protocol. So even patients who are on prescription medications need a baseline regimen. And this is my regimen of choice as a practicing clinical dermatologist for my acne patients.